Trump wants sentencing postponed until after election. This is acceptable to the DA. Former President Donald Trump's plea for a sentencing delay for falsifying business documents to hide hush money paid to a porn star was boosted Monday when prosecutors didn't address it. Trump's lawyers asked Judge Juan Merchant to postpone his September 18 sentencing until after the November election. They say appellate courts should intervene before sentencing if Merchant rejects Trump's request to overturn his conviction based on the Supreme Court's presidential immunity judgment. Since Manhattan District Attorney Alvin Bragg's office didn't oppose that request, Merchant has less motivation to rule against it, even if the decision is still his, contrary to Trump's claim. Prosecutors wrote Merchant that there are significant reasons why Trump shouldn't appeal an immunity determination until after his sentence. However, they indicated they would defer to the court on whether a delay is needed to avoid an appellate court that disagrees with sentence preparations. Merchant expected to rule on Trump's motion to overturn the conviction on September 16. To preparation for Trump's sentencing September 18, prosecutors said numerous government organizations must take significant public safety and logistical steps. Trump's wish to appeal before sentencing, presuming Merchant rules against him on immunity, could be in vain if Merchant sticks to the sentencing date but an appeals court intervenes. Trump pleaded guilty to 34 felonies of manipulating company records to illegally meddle in the 2016 election on May 30. He dismisses prosecutors' claim that Trump ordered a $130,000 payment to Stormy Daniels to stay quiet about his 2006 encounter. A unanimous Manhattan jury found Trump's payment reimbursement paperwork forged, according to Trump's motion, a portion of the Supreme Court's recent presidential immunity ruling that was backed by five of the six Republican-appointed justices means the jury shouldn't have seen evidence of official presidential acts.